In this video, I'm going to be doing a review of the Splice Video Editor app that you can get on the iOS App Store. So let's begin. As you can see, I have several photo and video apps. And here's Splice. The bad thing about the Splice Video edit Editor app is that it has to have internet, which seems kind of crazy, but there may be reasons for that. But that's just one downside. So make sure you have good internet before you try to edit a project. Okay, so I'll cl click on this project right here. And as you saw, you could press the plus button if you want to start a new one. Okay, so you can add music, titles, sound effects, voice, um, text, and you can even add music. So as you see here, I have added text for like a type for a title text and you can double tap to edit and you can edit what it says and you can change the color, the font, the background, how it's aligned, opacity but you can't put borders around it except for those colors I'll keep it black and then here's your timeline it's called and you can see your video that you've uploaded into this and to trim um, what you do is you tap on one of the timelines and you drag with your finger like this You can also crop the video. Other things you can do are when you click on a video, um, you can also adjust sharpness, saturation, contrast, exposure, and you can add filters. Some people might like that. You can also add animations. You can change, I guess, change the background somehow. And you can duplicate your video timeline files, and you can delete them, of course. Here's a transform button. That must be you can rotate. So this app has some nice features. As you see, it's plain. In this video, we are going to be reviewing the app Just Press Record. So let's t and you can listen for any things you need to fix, of course. And you can also trim the endings of other video files, like right coming up here shortly, right here. It has a little icon that shows that one video file stops and another one starts so either side is a different file just tap on which one you wanna start editing and then you're good to go with your editing so this app has several features you can do add music, add titles however the title feature isn't as sophisticated as, as it probably should be but they do give you some options you can also add sound effects. They have a bunch of different kinds. You can record your voice. You can add text. And with the music, they have several different ones you can use for free, which is very nice. You can even import music, and, and you can use iTunes. And so when you're done with your video, after you've made sure everything is edited in the way you like it, what you do is press this button with the arrow and you can push how many frames per second um, you can push what resolution you want and it'll tell you how much time it might take and how much storage it'll probably take 
So you can either save it or share it. And if you push share, it starts exporting it. And here's the home menu. The I button, you can leave feedback, contact support, terms of service. Um, with the plus button, of course, you can start a new project. And with the just press record review project, I can press this these three dots. And I can rename it or duplicate it or delete it. So this app, app has some nice features. Has quite a bit of music and sound effects, which are cool. One thing I would suggest for a potential upgrade to this app would be make it so you don't have to have internet and make it so there's more options for titles or title editing and one more thing that might be nice would be to have more animation options like trans um, transferring from one video to another maybe you have like transition slides that might be nice but overall this is a it's really good for a free app. They did a good job. They recently updated it this summer or spring in 2019. So that was nice. So if you need a video editor app, consider Splice. They do a good job and they'll probably improve as they go on in the future. So thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you liked it. If you have any suggestions, please comment below. And subscribe if you want to see more videos like this. Thanks so much for watching and have a great day.